Today, there's a new inquiry being launched by MPs into the East Coast mainline. Also, a story in the Financial Times about Transport for London having a potentially a billion pound deficit by next year. And one of the problems for both of those issues is passenger numbers, yep. much lower than previously expected, both for the East Coast Main Line and for Transport for London on the Tube network. Not as many people getting public transport in those areas and all these expectations of lots more passengers getting on the train. You know, HS2 is built heavily on lots more people wanting to get the train. Could that affect future projects if we're not getting uh, public transport as much?